welcome back to another video um, in this one I'm going to show you what I got from my games haul because we have been away for a night I won't say we've been away for the weekend because we set off yesterday to go to like um, a family friends party that was in Lincoln I think somewhere in Lincoln um, so it's kind of like a mini trip it was cool we had a blast went uh, had a few few drinkies it was good had some good times with the friends of the families and then today on the way home I don't know why the lighting's like really bright today um, today on the way back before we left we popped into the town that was nearby and I saw a CEX and you know what I'm like for CEX I'm just like come to me come to me so <laughs> I'm gonna show you what I got um, I got quite a few PS2 collections I also got a couple next-gen consoles games mm -hmm. so I'll start with them because we um, will save the best till last so this light is really awful today it's too bright if I step back, will that help? <laughs> anyway, so first things first. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 5. Now, I didn't know this was a thing for next gen. So as soon as I saw it, I picked it up because I thought, I want to try that. So, it's got a lot of fingerprints on it. He's wiping. I don't know if you can see that. This lighting is horrible. So we got that. Condition of the case isn't too bad. That was a tenner. So we got that. Um, Division PS4 was only a fiver. Uh, I've never played this. I've seen a mate play it, but I've never played it myself. Um, and I didn't really pay attention to him when he was playing it. I was just like, eh, it's all right. But for a fiver, I'll play it myself and I'll give it a good go. So we got that. And then FIFA Street 50p. Comes with a manual. What's the condition of the disc like? Oh, it's not too bad. The case itself is a bit. I don't know if you can see it, it's a bit beat up there. It's a bit dirty, but we got that. America's Most Wanted, 50p. Can't complain for 50p. Disc isn't too bad. It's going to be awkward trying to show you these with the lighting, but this isn't too bad. No manual. Case is a bit dirty, but apart from that, can't complain. Brothers in Arms, Road to Hill 30. 50p. I don't think it comes with a manual, but it comes with all the, like, you know, leaflets inside. Again... I don't know if I can show you properly, but the disc needs a good clean. As does the other stack of games that I got the other weekend. Um, Splinter Cell Pandora tomorrow. 50p. This feels heavy. Yep, yeah, comes with a manual. Disc is not too bad. They all look the same to you on camera, don't they? You can't really tell. You can't really tell with that. Uh, the case isn't in too bad nick. Rainbow Six Lockdown, 50p. This comes with the leaflets and such. Doesn't come with a manual, which is fine. Because, like, stuff like this, I'm not really bothered about completes. Again, you can't really see the condition of the disc, but it's a bit... Needs a clean. Like any, you don't really get, like, a, a really spot-on condition game from CX, to be honest with you. Especially when it's PS2. Time Crisis 2... A pound doesn't come. Well, it is a PlayStation game in case I don't think it was. Comes with the manuals. That's very dirty and very scratched up. Need to need to check that. I wipe it. Oh, you can see it a bit there. That needs a bit of TLC. And then last one. Time Crisis Three. If the lighting will allow it. £1.50 comes with a manual and stuff that's not too bad ok 
can't really see it, but that's not too bad. And then, as I was at the till, I saw something in the glass cabinet. And the price of this varies on like eBay and such. But today I found it at the cheapest price and it's cheaper than eBay. So we have got, I've teased this on Twitter. Um, Tetris for the Game Boy. Yeah, Tetris for the Game Boy. Does this make me a YouTuber now if I put my hand up against it? Um, the condition is pretty good to be honest with you. It's a bit yellowy up here and a bit dirty. I don't know if you can see it. And that needs cleaning off the back. So we need to give that a good clean. But apart from that, like especially the label, if you look at the label, the label's in pretty good nick. And this was £4. So I thought, you know, for £4, I can't really turn down taking home Tetris on the Game Boy. So that is everything. Uh, I think what I'm going to do now, I'm going to test, I'm going to test Tetris. Test Tetris. Uh, might install the Division and Tony Hawk's Pro Skater, and I'm going to have a dabble at them. I think. So yeah, just wanted to uh, to show you what I got. Um, I don't know how regular these are going to be. You know, I'm not turning into like some games haul channel, but. You know, this is this is like my diary in it. So if I've bought something and I want to update you and put it in my diary, I'll put it in my diary. So this this is the stack that we that we came home with today, which I'm pretty pleased with to be honest with you. Um normally my goal when I go into a CEX shop is spend no more than twenty quid. And there's twenty quid there. And then I had some um Physical monies, because I got them on card, I had physical monies. So I got Tetris with my physical money. So overall, a very good weekend. So I'm going to crack on with sorting these out, installing these. And I'm going to chill out for a bit. So much appreciated for watching, if you did. Um, I'll probably speak to you on Twitter. And feel free to share it with your friends and family. And I will see you when I see you. Bye! Wow, I'm really white.